Right, today I've got a tip for you, and it's about floating notification, which you may have seen on the new Facebook launcher or the Facebook phone from HTC. So let's take a look. So as you can see, it flips across all home pages, and if you get a notification like my little email here, you click on the email and it shows you all the emails that have arrived. Now I've set it to tell me everything that Google tells me has arrived in my account, which is obviously far too much. So in a minute I'll go to the settings and I'll disable that and show you how to do it. So you can see I've got my emails that have arrived that the notification told me about. Now to install this application, you just need to download the link in the description and sideload it. And what I mean by that is just clicking on the application itself, the APK, and clicking on install, and it's done. So you'll need to make sure you've, under developer options, you've ticked unknown sources. And once you've installed the application, you need to go to your device, and then go to accessibility. And if I scroll down a little bit, you'll see there's an option for floating notification. And you just need to tick that and make it on. And it's as simple as that. Once you've done that, like now I'll click on, and it comes up with my notification. Once you've done that, in your app tray, there'll be a notification settings option. So if you click on that and you swipe across to apps, you can then check the apps that you want to be notified within that notification icon. So I'm going to take off Google. I'm just going to leave on Hangouts. I'm going to leave my messages on and I'm going to leave my emails on. And that's pretty much all I really want to be notified about. Now I have a message that I unchecked, so I haven't read it. If I click on it, and then click on the little black dialog box underneath it, I can then go inside my messages. And if I don't want to check my message, if I just double tap the actual notification icon like this, I'll move it down, double tap it, and it will hide it. So now I can't see that notification at all. So I'll show you one more time, I'll tick on a message to say that I haven't read it, it pops up with a message there, click on it once, click on the little black dialog box underneath it, and it goes to my message. So thanks for watching guys, and I'll be back again with some more little tips and tricks later on. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and yeah, get into it. Thanks.